Good evening YouTube friends and family. This is Laura coming to you with a short video and today we're going to talk about selfish people. Selfish people. Well, what is a selfish person? A selfish person is someone whose mind basically is always on self. They can see no further than what they want at the time or what they need and so they may come to you with great swelling words about us and we and it's a team but no sooner than you connect with this person you will find out that it was never about us it was always about them it was always about what they wanted, their agenda, and what they could get out of the deal. A selfish person, if you connect with them in a relationship or a business relationship, you will find out that a selfish person will destroy everything that you've ever tried to build or everything that you have built. A selfish person will jeopardize everything. Not some things, everything. When you connect with a selfish person, you will find that everything can be lost because of your connection with this person. Everything will be in jeopardy. So, what are some of the, the characteristics of a selfish person? A selfish person is all about self-gratification. As I talked about before, it's all about I, me, what I want. It's all about what will make them happy. It, it's all about what will help to forward their agenda or their cause or to help them get ahead. It is all about what will make their life easier and happier and get this, at the expense of someone else. And my friend, if you're connected with this person in a relationship, a personal relationship or a business relationship, that person will be you. That someone else will be you. And it's all because of they have to have what they want when they want it. There's no delayed gratification. They can't see past or think about what would be the best for everybody involved. They will never think about or think in the terms of a win-win situation. It will always be about how can I win and they lose. It's that me against them mentality or us against them or them against us mentality. A selfish person is all about self-preservation. That's another characteristic of a selfish person. They will step on your head and anyone else's head that gets in their way. They will bulldoze over in order to move forward or to get ahead. And they take no you know, they're not a um, respecter of persons, if I could say that. A selfish person is not a respecter of person. It could be mother, father, sister, brother, son, daughter, grandmother, whoever. They will step on your head in order to get ahead. For example, let's say you were being chased by two vicious dogs, you and a selfish person. And you're both running from these dogs. And let's say you move ahead of the selfish person maybe by an inch or two. A selfish person will grab you by the arm, pull you back, or they will do something to trip you to make sure that they escape the vicious dogs at your expense. Remember I keep saying that it's at your expense. And so... They never want to see you happy. A selfish person 
will never ever want to see you happy. Like I said, they will talk the talk, but they don't want to see you happy. It's all about connecting to you to get what they want or knocking you down a few pegs because they're absolutely miserable if you're doing well and if you're moving forward and if you're happy. They're absolutely miserable. They do not want to see you get ahead. It's all about them getting ahead. And by any means necessary, they will try to get ahead. So let's look at if you're in business with a selfish person. You will know that you're in business with a selfish person because the selfish person will start making executive decisions without even consulting you. It's like, hold on, wait a minute. Aren't we partners? Why did you go ahead and do this without talking to me about it? Why are you making these decisions without even consulting me? Well, uh, uh, I thought it would be best for us, or I thought it would be best for the business, or I just went, you know, just all these silly excuses. But behind it all is it's all about me. I did this. I made these executive decisions for me. It's not about you. And so we're connecting with these people and we find ourselves absolutely miserable because, you know, misery loves company. And so you're connecting with someone that's miserable and they they function on a spirit of lack. And so that's why they're so selfish. They got to have everything they see, everything they want, you know, me, 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 because they're operating from a perspective of lack instead of perspective that there's enough for everybody. Or if we work together, we all can have something. We all can get it done. We all can move forward together. But with a selfish person, they can't see any further than past the tip of their nose. And so, you know, if you pay attention, you'll see the red flags if you're dealing with a selfish person. Because it will start off with us and we, and we're a team, but watch quickly how the conversation will shift as time goes on and it will stop being about we and the team and it will shift to I, 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 me, me, me. And another sign to watch for, and this is something that is definitely very clear cut. A selfish person will always be greedy. They will always be greedy. Selfishness and greed go hand in hand. A selfish person is will be very greedy. They will always want, 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 want. It will always go hand in hand. And so before you connect with anyone, you know, watch out, listen to the conversation, take your time, watch out for the red flags, because you know what? Connecting with a selfish person could jeopardize everything. You could lose it all by one mistake, one bad connection, and you could lose it all. Well, I'm going to end the video at this point. If you enjoy the content of my YouTube channel, please like, subscribe, leave a comment, and share. And as always, until we meet again, bye-bye, my friends.